The persecution of Uyghurs in Xinjiang by the Chinese government is being called a genocide by human rights advocates. The U.S. Embassy to the Holy See hosted a webinar to call attention to the Chinese government's crimes against humanity. Kulchera Hoya, a journalist and Uyghur herself, shared her own experience of the government's harsh repression. Unfortunately, the Chinese government sees any religion as a threat to its rule. And the, therefore, it is trying its best to get away with this genocide by silencing all of us, including me. The Chinese government has sent at least 24 members of Hoya's family to concentration camps, and she has been accused of terrorism and put on a government watch list. For Uyghurs today, um, choosing faith is uh, tantamount to choosing death. Yet, they have not lost faith in justice. Here they are, true believers. Since 2018, over 15,000 mosques and cemeteries in Uyghur regions have been destroyed. And as of June 2020, 613 imams are reported missing. The United States, the European Union, the United Kingdom and Canada have been coordinating sanctions against human rights abusers, including perpetrators of atrocities in Xinjiang.